Hey Libra, hey Pisces from GetPisces.com, and I'm here with your August 2015 love edition. Let's go. Okay, Libra. What I feel about you. I feel like you may want to make peace with somebody. And then on the other hand, you want to maybe start something new with somebody else. I feel like you want to make peace with the old situation and then the new situation. I feel like you're feeling your way out, kind of trying to see if you should pursue somebody, okay, or not. But I feel like if this is the case for you, I feel like the other person that you're pursuing is trying to fill you out too. <laughs> That's what it feels like. It's like they want to fill you out at the same time. So let me just do the shuffle of the cards. Because I got the cards here. Alright. Okay. Mm -hmm. Um, you could possibly I think maybe coming up here soon this month, I think that you'll be able to spend more time with the person that you're feeling out and I feel like you'll be able to get to know this person and it might end up being some long term I mean hell it might be the person you want to marry honest with you. okay alright <laughs> makes sense here we go now first card the Page of Pentacles. Okay. Then we have the Seven of Swords reversed. We have the Three of Wands upright and the Queen of Cups. And at the bottom of the deck is the Three of Cups. Okay, so what I feel like these are saying. Um, you letting it be known what it is that you want. A new relationship. I think that your kind of hoping this may be in a relationship at the same time you're not sure where it's going to go you're not sure if the other person is filling you out but I feel like the other person does like you I just think that they're waiting on you but one of y'all is going to break because I kind of feel like we're going to get to the point where with you and this other person that nobody can hold back anymore and it'll almost be like one of those movie type things where you like kiss or something <laughs> hey I don't make this shit up the three of wands here, I feel like this is you looking forward to something new with the other person. Alright, the new person. And I feel like you'll understand this by spending time with them. Okay. Now the Queen of Cups reversed obviously is going to be the person that you try to make peace with. I don't feel like they're going to want to make peace with you because I feel like the person that you're trying to be finished with is going to be upset that you're moving on. Wow. Here's the wish card. I mean... It don't get any better than this. I don't even know if I'm going to stop the reading right now. I might just stop. I ain't going to stop in three minutes. Y'all be mad at me. But I feel like, okay, I feel like this is between you and the new person. I feel like the new person may turn out to be what it is that you want. Despite the differences between you, I feel like you and the new person are going to get cozy together. Alright, I might I mean I see you may even be moving in with this new person soon enough. But I would encourage you to wait until after Venus is out of its retrograde period. I'm just saying. With the Page of Cups. The Page of Cups is saying that this new love will get started. Okay, so with the Page of Pentacles. The Page of Pentacles, I feel like it's saying like you're offering yourself up. You're kind of making it known. I'm not going to say you're flirting or whatever, but I feel like you are open up emotionally to this new person. And I think that, like I said, after you guys spend some time together, then you'll get emotional. You know, the emotions will start to grow between you and you end up, because you, cause you'll see a future in it here with the three of wands, and then you'll end up getting what it is that you want. It's almost dreamy. It's like um like you're meeting this person that you didn't think was like right under your nose and you got to spend time with them and then 
Three of Pentacles is you and this person working together, I feel like, to build a... Oh, my Lord, I don't believe, bro. This is a good-ass reading. The Ace of Cups. Okay, so the Ace of Cups here. This new relationship that you're ready to get into? Wow. I feel like it's going to lead to a really deep love relationship. Like I said, I really feel like this person is kind of like for you. It's so much emotion in these cards. I mean, I feel it like... Okay, we have the Ace of Cups, the Nine of Cups, the Three of Cups, the Page of Cups, Page of Pentacles, and the Three of Wands. I see that as a relationship that is open and honest with the Seven of Swords being reversed. Open and honest and has a long-term future. That's what it looks like. Libra, oh my gosh. Y'all gotta let me know what happens. I mean, I got Libra Moon, so I mean, but still. Wow, this is insane. With the King of Swords here, this relationship is more, I feel like it's more than just mental. I think you'll start coming to the realization that this person is somebody that you can deal with long term. And this really could be a good relationship. What the hell? This is a good ass reading, y'all. I mean, like, thumbs up. Now, it looks like we're back to the other person. The other person is going to feel like they're out in the cold. But you know what? If you're not meant to be with that other person, I don't give a damn. If you have kids, a dog, a, a mortgage. See, I shouldn't have said that. I, I just feel like, what's the point in staying in something that you don't want to be in? When you can find happiness and contentment somewhere else. The feeling that's coming over me is just so warm and so inviting and so loving. This relationship that I feel like you could cultivate with this person is could be lifelong. Like It's going to be a long-term relationship, I believe. Because I feel like you and this person meld together and you, you'll fit to each other. Okay? Okay, so with the Eight of Swords here, I feel like you may have to cut off the other person. But I really feel like you have your... I mean, cut off... You may have to stop talking to them for a while, but then you may not. But I feel like emotionally, you got to shut off to the other person because the justice here... I mean, what if you get married to this person? What if you marry them? Wow. Okay. <laughs> Just saying. King of Cups is here. The King of Cups is saying, wow, I mean, this is a good ass. This is a good reading. I don't think I've given Libra a reading this good. I don't know. But Libra, ooh. Mm. If you're dealing with somebody that you got the smallest bit of feelings for, that you think that it may be something, I would say pursue it. Because it looks like it could be a really good ass relationship. I mean, it feels so warm and so loving. Ugh. I just want to get my cover. <laughs> I want to get a cover, you know, and lay in it and get on my new couch that I sat on about 10 times because I don't even be out there. Anyway, y'all. This is K Pisces from KPisces.com. Check me out for a tell all no host bar reading. No lies, no lies, no lies, honey. You want lies? Look at America's. I ain't got none for you. Congratulations, Libra. All right, y'all. Check me out.